Stefan Brattle tested the latest updates to the Honda RC213V at the Harare circuit ahead of the MotoGP shakedown test on February 1st to 3rd in Sepang, Malaysia. Welcome to the Paddock Garage channel. Don't forget to subscribe, like, and comment. Taking advantage of the concession allowance, Honda immediately stepped on the gas when the winter test tire regulations were completed. Together with the HRC SBK team, they brought the updated Honda RC213V to be tested by Stefan Brattle in Harais. This Honda V4 prototype motorbike has several quite obvious differences compared to the Valencia test version sold by Mir, Marini, Zarco, and Nakagami. Through photos obtained by GP1 and Speedweek, it is revealed that there are several differences, including a new 100% aluminum swing arm, new frame, revised front winglet fins, and the tail section, including updated stern winglets. You can see that the updated RC213V swing arm is getting longer. Indeed, currently the development of aero and ride height devices is a trend, with the physical design of motorbikes tending to be longer than MotoGP in the previous era. The aft aero looks smaller than the aft winglet of the F1 car previously used by HRC in the Valencia test. And one more thing, after appearing without a cable bridge from the side fairing to the upper tank hump at the Valencia test, the Honda RC213V is back with this bridge cover both on the right and left of the upper side fairing which runs across the perimeter chassis beam. What is quite interesting is the fact that after Marc Marquez left, HRC no longer used an air tunnel for cooling the rear caliper, which is usually placed on the lower right side of the swing arm. It is estimated that this update will be the initial basis for the shakedown test in early February at Sepang, Malaysia. In yesterday's test, Stefan Brattle completed 73 laps, the fastest in 1 minute and 39.368 seconds, which means he was 1.076 seconds behind superbike rookie Nicolo Bulega who recorded the best time.